Today I want to talk about a fascinating concept that can revolutionize the way we connect with others. The power of leaning in. You see, as humans, we naturally gravitate towards people, things and ideas we find interesting. And when we lean in, something magical happens. Our five senses become heightened, allowing us to fully immerse ourselves in the moment. Think about it for a moment. Have you ever found yourself leaning in to get a closer look at a beautiful painting or catch every word of a captivating story? Have you ever leaned in during a conversation because you genuinely wanted to understand the other person better? These subtle movements speak volumes. Leaning in is a signal of interest and it's an incredibly powerful tool to make others feel valued and important. Let me give you an example. Imagine you are attending a conference and one of the speakers leans in as they share their insights. Their eyes sparkle, their voice resonates with passion and their body language exudes genuine curiosity. As an audience member, you can't help but be captivated. Their leaning in creates a magnetic connection making you feel like the most interesting person in the room. Leaning in isn't limited to physical proximity either. In this digital age, even on video calls, we have the power to lean in and show our engagement. Picture yourself on a virtual meeting, leaning towards the screen, actively listening and nodding attentively. Your colleagues will instantly feel your interest and dedication and it will encourage a more meaningful and productive conversation. So let's make a conscious effort to embrace the art of leaning in. It's a small action that yields incredible results. When we lean in, we show others that they matter, that their words and ideas have value. Leaning in is the fastest way to foster connections and create an environment of genuine engagement. Leaders make a point of leaning in. Lean in when talking to colleagues, friends, when you want to show you agree, when you want to emphasize the important points in your presentation. One of the worst things we could do is leaning back slouching or reclining while someone is sharing something that's important to them. Don't lean when you disagree with others. Remember whether you are sitting, standing, on stage or in a virtual spaces, leaning in is a universal language of interest. It's a compliment that can transform ordinary interactions into extraordinary moment. Let's harness the power of leaning in and embrace the joy of truly connecting with one another. Until we meet again, be safe and sound. Bye-bye.